Hey Tepi Squad, welcome to another video. If you're new here, welcome. If you've been part of the Tepi Squad for a while now, welcome back, honey. I know I've been gone for a while, guys, but I have a valid reason for that. Um, ho, malaifi. But before I get into that, I have some exciting news for you guys. I have a promotion, my first ever paid promotion ever since I started taking this channel over a load. I put on a necklace I got from New Eyes Age. New Eyes Age, guys, like Shopo A, it's very affordable to start with. They sell more things, you know, they sell elegant things, uh, jewelry you can use. How oh, yeah, keep looking to this us. Okay, they have um men necklaces. Ne? The lowest price is 70 rand and the highest is 90 rand. Like imagine a necklace ya munna. It costa 70 rand. Yo, they have ladies rings, um the most pieces, the ring, you get you can get 13 pieces of rings from them. Imagine. At a price of what? Let me see. At a price of 65 rands. Imagine. They also have um, iPhone pouches. Um, the one on. Can I please uh, 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 take out the iPhone pouch of this phone so that I can show you guys an example? Those who know know that my favorite color is purple. I got this amazing pouch. I don't know if you can, uh, let it focus. Thank nation. It's written keep smiling. Uh, I got this pouch from New Ice Age and it's very, very, very affordable. Uh, the lowest price, yeah, a pouch is 50 rands. I can get pouch of 50 rand because the pouch is 100 and something rand for my friend. And you know, yeah. They have women necklaces, the half heart necklace. They have a lot of things. They have a variety of stuff you guys can get. They literally have everything. They also have like the anklets. The anklets are the necklace. I'm joking. They sent me um, this necklace. Okay, this one is my favorite. It was also sent for me, like sent to me from New Age. It's my favorite. It's the one I like because it can go everywhere, basically. And then there's this one. This one is a new one. It's a very nice one. It's a special occasion because, like, you know, yeah. Like, it's this one. Let me do this for you guys to see it properly. It's this one. Laibona ikulu yang vatli e wash matung neklisak and I see biki it's in I see biki bulay siki recipe because it's my favorite key busy nako in we esiras. Yeah. They also sent me rings. Um I I opened them. I had to reshoot this because I felt like Nikisa Bonakalisin. Yeah, they also gave me rings. This one has a moon. A moon sign in front of it and this one has a star sign in front of it so yes now I'd really advise you guys to order yourself uh, 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 anything jewelry there because they're really affordable uh, deliveries are included they deliver then this is most definitely the store for you guys I'm back now and I'm sure you guys can see that my energy is no longer that hyped up I think one of the reasons is because I'm taking this video at night and another reason is because um, I've been going through quite a lot and I just want to vent to you guys just tell you guys what has been going on in my life and give you uh, guys a small Anyana life update so I jotted down things down here so if this is in case if I might forget something so if I do look down please don't mind me I jotted down everything that has been happening in my life so that I cannot leave anything behind okay so this is what has been happening basically I'm gonna start here and take it to activate the happy mood when you get like a blending okay so this is how i've really really been okay i've been okay guys honestly i'm not gonna lie to you guys i've been okay but uh mental health guys mental health 
o tshwanetseng o beteng to be quite honest with you guys and i'm not gonna lie to you guys gere it only started no yeah na kabo may or kabo june july when i start when i stopped shooting uh it has been going on for a while now like ever since uh february this year i haven't been okay it's just that i've been trying to be strong uh not only for myself but whoo not only for myself but for for people around me and i feel like um going home had a huge impact in me going back to not being fine again because i was away from my friends to be honest i'd like to send a shout out to my friends especially khonzi and totally so they've been there for me like throughout thick and thin and i haven't been fine for the longest time but when i was with them i was like always motivated khoriki it took for me to bounce back basically that's what i'm trying to say okay so um the last time i saw you guys was the week before i went home so i went home guys and i was unable to shoot go high because i was basically at home near my family so um for the sake of my privacy go high and for the sake of them not finding me weird you understand but like yeah that's that's fine and before i went home guys uh i failed the first semester i'm not embarrassed to say this i failed the first semester and i had a lot going on in my life um first and foremost uh i have okay my housemates are passing so i don't know if you guys can hear the sound but then it's fine yeah so uh my mom has been gone uh, i can't tell you guys where she is but yeah she's been gone there for like a while so i couldn't really cope every time i went home my mom wasn't there like and every like you guys know how we like hi um yeah but i have gotten a chance to see her once or twice but it wasn't the way i am used to it being because it's not at home so yeah so my mom has been gone and um another thing is that like I'm going to be quite honest. I promised you guys that I'll no longer talk about this thing ever again on my channel, but I feel like you guys deserve to know the truth. After my break up with my ex, <clears throat> it happened hore I zoned out more pilong like um I felt like there's no reason for me to do certain things anymore and school was one of them. One talaga but uh, like if if i can put it put it this way i was a bit deep motivated because the person i was dating was the one who was motivating me so i started um banking classes i started missing classes i started not doing my school work i started not studying so at that period i think uh, that thing started cabo march march to Be, uh, beginning or the end of february the end of april to the beginning of may that's um when like shit started in my life so um me being absent to go school for that long nikki attend the when like ki fila gore i can get out of bed i was always in bed most of the times uh I didn't eat. Got like a lot of things was going on, were going on. I only ate when I was with people. I didn't even bother to buy groceries because when I was alone I didn't eat. I only like went to my friends places, because there was the warmth that I needed. I was around people and what not. So yeah, I zoned out a bit from school and I uh, I like um i was too behind i failed to catch up i couldn't catch up so um but i qualified for like to write all my exams but i failed most of my exams so i yeah so i failed my first semester um yeah um only my close friends know this and my family so i'm putting it out there because i'm not embarrassed to say that i made a mistake and i realized that 
uh, if you bunk classes guys or if you don't go to school uh, it, you will find it hard to catch up so like maybe if uri how is going in a hurry in in my school we have two classes in a week if ever you say how is going in a hurry maybe you attend that class a one and then in which you can now yeah i i went weeks without going to school i was always crying like nigga say sharp but now i'm good guys honestly so i'm good i'm not gonna lie to you guys pele nigga pretend like is a mahuba sharp for the sake of you know yeah but i'm okay now i i also joined a new choir as you guys know i was singing for anointed armor of god uh as you guys know that so uh, i changed choirs uh, i went from uh anointed armor of god gospel choir to that or how artist movement so i'm singing for a new choir now it's it's a new environment new people and whatnot i hope it will bring um the excitement in my life that i um i'm i want yeah anointed of um uh, anointed armor of god was really really amazing guys it's just that there's a few things that i can't mention for you guys that made me leave but it's not it's not a big deal because they're still my brothers and sisters i'll support them any day anyhow and yeah they're part of my prayer warriors as well those people pray hey yeah so yeah i mean gabarata and i'll always be there for them and it's still you know something like home away from home it's so mm, part of my home away from home when i'm here in mafiki those people are still my brothers and sisters and my friends so yeah my mc journey my mc journey is starting guys uh, as you all know that i'm in mc right so my first the huge huge gig uh, it's the explosion 22 it's starting this weekend i get this weekend give what 48 hours from now if i'm not mistaken today is thursday explosion is on saturday so it's my first gig uh i told myself that i'm going to vlog the whole experience to show you guys how it went how how it was and whatever i hope i can do that for you guys but uh hang around if it doesn't happen i'll tell you guys in my next video that it didn't happen okay i opened a tiktok channel now i'm on tiktok and i get some like 4k followers so far and 30 something k likes yeah man and it has been a really really nice experience i can be myself as i am here on youtube but yeah i mean yeah guys uh, i also wanted to tell you guys that i've been attending therapy koskolo mm? it has been the most difficult journey um i never i i am not a person who believes in talking to someone i don't know about my problems but it has been helping me a lot eh ke fela ka re morwalo o montse mo phelong ba ka o rolegile no yana because i felt like i was alone without my mom because you guys know that she's gone she's not here so she's coming back soon hey she's coming back soon so i'll be able to go home to my mom again yeah so i feel like um ntse go le thatanyana mo bophelong ke le zoned out yeah so yeah i've been attending therapy so um now that like as i was saying that my mom is gone and i i've been finding out like finding it hard to talk to just anyone i've been talking to my friends and obviously they can't do anything but give out advices and what not so with a the therapist you guys through i think go through this journey with them they advise you what to do you guys take it step by step you unpack everything like every problem you have in your life you understand so i've been doing that and it's been going quite well as you guys can see khuri ke montle nyana no yana yeah man so yeah that's basically what has been happening in my life and i know i promised you guys a lot of content and i didn't give it out it's because of like guys how se sharp like o se sharp o fila gore wena how sharp 
why come okay i i i i have done it before but i couldn't do it anymore the pressure was so bad that i couldn't handle it why come in front of the camera and pretend you understand yeah but right now i feel like i i i bounced back into this life thing a lot of people couldn't see that i'm not okay because i've always put a front and whatnot yeah man other than that like everything has been going well i've been attending school but i'm hoping for the best this semester uh, i'm hoping for better things i hope yeah man and my really i went back to church i'm back at church guys i forgot to tell you guys that uh, before this i before the time i went to church uh august i wasn't i i haven't been at church for like two years ever since the pandemic and i think that's why i i'm also fixing my relationship with god uh, so yeah man i hope you guys enjoyed this life update um i hope you guys now know what has been going on in my life there has been a lot going on i even went to a, in, I, I even mistakenly it was not a mistake jiggy jiggy i started smoking but i i stopped because i realized hurry it's not for me it's not grand it's not ladylike i'm not saying that people who smoke are not ladylike for me one tell her it's like i can do i can move you go back to me can take a deal and so yeah i think that's all i think i'm done for today uh after this video i'm shooting another story time for you guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to like subscribe share this video and i love you guys a lot Bye.